Hey guys, this is Naveen here. Welcome back to Naveen Automation Lab. So today's question is about you have to print a string, for example, hello world, without using a semicolon in Java. A couple of people were asking, actually, I prepared one video also a couple of years back, the same thing with some different options. Today, we are going to talk about some other couple of options also, although not a great interview question. I don't prefer such kind of questions, but still, if somebody is asking, and uh, you should know that how to handle this. There are ways that, yes, you can use uh, without semicolon also, you can just print any specific string. For example, let's say if, if you write it system.out.println, printing hello world here, you are using semicolon at the end of this statement because in Java, we know that every statement should be ended with a semicolon and it's absolutely working fine. But the question here is about without using a semicolon. Not a big fan of this question, but still people are asking and we should know that how to answer because in interview people, you know, can ask anything. So you just simply use one thing, one if statement, you can write it here. And then instead of writing system dot or print Allen, you write system dot out dot print F method for the print F method to pass the any formatted string. So let's see, for example, I'm writing print F and then I'm passing hello world here. Okay. Because this is what we have to print. Let's see. Hello world. And then here you can write if hello world is uh, something equal to equal to null that you can write it here like this. And then that's it. We are not using any semicolon at all, except this particular package name. You can just ignore the package name, but in the logic, I'm not writing any semicolon. Okay, so if you run this program, let's see hello world is getting printed or not. Yes, it's absolutely printing because the condition is actually true here. It's coming inside the if condition. But in if condition, I'm not writing anything. It's a blank if condition state, I mean, uh, uh, body, but it's printing hello world here. So this is fine. There are other ways also you can use that. What you can do here is that you can just simply write once again, uh, system dot out dot, uh, instead of writing print, you can use append method also. And this append method also returning the print stream class object. So I can do one thing. I can write once again, uh, hello world here and then here you can just compare with equal to equal to a null and then again you can just print it on the console so let's run it it's not generating a new line because of uh, we are not using print ln the moment you write print ln obviously then we have to use a semicolon so it's printing in the same line hello world if you really want to print in the new line what you can do you can just put a new a backslash n so that it will generate a new line so let's see this so here you can see yes hello world is getting printed in the new line and then I can use it with again, this guy also backslash n. If you really want to use with dot equals that also you can use it. So I quickly write that is uh, instead of double equal to null, you can just compare, let's see with dot equals to a uh, null or not like this also you can use it. And this also will give you without any semicolon, it's printing hello world. So this is a question actually when a student asked me via email and I thought of, okay, fine. Let me just uh, quickly cover that as well. So these are three ways you can use it if you do have any other ways to uh, print hello world or any specific string that you really want to print on the console just feel free to do that but make sure that okay you are not allowed to use a semicolon here you can just remove the package name you can just directly uh, create this particular cl class without package and then you don't need to use the semicolon but i'm talking about in the main logic that you are adding there you are not allowed to use any semicolon so pretty simple, pretty straightforward. Just remember this, if somebody is asking this question at a time of interview or maybe any online exam or something like that. So this is the right answer for that. That's all for this particular video, guys. I'll see you in the next video. Till then, take care and God bless you all.